Welcome back to Waterloo the Carp. Glorious sunset on the carp pond. Wednesday the uh, 19th of May. And it's about 10 past 8 in the evening as you can see the sun setting. Had a lovely barbecue this evening. And uh, I've got all three rods out now for the evening. So fingers crossed something will happen throughout the night of those. I'm uh, just going to insert a nice little capture I had recently, a couple of weeks ago. I didn't do any filming last week when I was on here on Wednesday night. It was absolutely belting down with rain all night. So uh, as you can see now, this is the lovely common I had out. I can't remember the exact size. It was around 23, I want to say 23, 8 or something like that. Let's have a quick look on the old Instagram post a moment and I'll soon be able to tell you exactly what size it was. <clears throat> so, I'm not going to show you, is it? Oh, look at that. What an awful picture quality. But there you go, look. It was a nice big common. I'll put, like I said, I'll put some pictures up of it in the main screen anyway. And, oh, sorry, yeah, and it's £23.5 ounces. Solid gold. <laughs> so that was my first one out of here this year. And I was over the moon with that. And uh, that's my second biggest one from here as well. So uh, it was open for tonight, eh? I'm the only one on, which is good. Nice and quiet on the lake. Not much traffic tonight, which is good as well. And uh, just gonna relax for the rest of the evening while the sun sets. Bit of classic trance in the background. And uh, I'm gonna be into the bivvy, catch some Z's, and don't forget catch some carp in the night. <laughs> Uh, anyway, we'll see you in a bit. Well, I suppose this can only mean one thing. About 20 minutes ago, if that, 15, the left hand rod uh, went tearing off. And I got myself a decent common down there. So, uh, yeah, brilliant. I thought I was, uh, I'd lost my chance really. It's coming up to five o'clock now. Well, it's just gone five o'clock and I was expecting to get one about one. Anyone between half past ten, one, half one last night and it just didn't happen. Uh, no bleeps or anything like that. And uh, I was sat there making myself a coffee and it went off. I was like, pucker. Anyway, the fish has been retained for a minute. Let him catch his breath. <clears throat> We're all ready to go here. I'm just going to go have a quick sip of my coffee before it goes cold and uh, we'll almost be ready for pictures so uh, give me another 10 minutes in there just to um, recover a little bit and uh, yeah let me get up for some pics and some video anyway what a puck and water on the pond and what a result as well anyway we'll speak to you in a bit well he I uh said last night that that common I had two weeks ago was my second biggest from this lake. Well, I've topped it again. Still second biggest by a couple of ounces. Um, but this was 24, two ounces. And it's a absolutely beautiful common. Absolutely lovely. So like I said, I just weighed it. Took off the weight for the retainer. <clears throat> 24, two. So, uh, Lovely fish, right, so let's get them up for you and show you. I don't want to keep it out too long. I've got to get to work, get packed up and go to work. Oh, hang on, let's get some of that scum off him. Make him look a bit more presentable. Oop, steady. Like that. Oh, ho, ho. He's not, hang on, let's get my tag off him. It's not settling in a minute, he's a bit, kind of a bit stiff. But look at that. For a beautiful carp pond common. <laughs> Absolute pucker. He's putting his dorsal up for us as well. That is a beauty, and that is what I come fishing for. Pucker! Anyway, guys, like I said, don't want to keep it out too much longer. So uh, let's get her back. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. Pucker.
Away you go, my lovely. Well, the clock's slowly wound down. Literally just got three rods on the deck now, all the kits away. And um, another 20 minutes and I'm off home. Gotta go to work. But uh, I said that was my second biggest fish in the pond. I was wrong. It's the biggest by one ounce. So a new pond PB. Pucker. Anyway, we'll see you on the next one. What is it, 14th today, isn't it? Yeah. Welcome back to another waterloaded carp, and uh, it's the 14th of September. And it's done a quick overnight on the pond. It's my third one in the last couple of weeks. And uh, you found found a nice little spot out there off the weeds. And uh, first time using, sorry, first time using the braid and uh, little bugs half tones which my brother gave me. So it's resorted in this 21 pound eight ounce common. So I'm well happy to have this one. Third common this year from the pond. So we'll just keep going now. Hopefully now they're on the munch, we'll have a few more before it gets cold. Anyway, let's get her back. That's Pucker. Let's get to work, I suppose. Let's see you on the next one. <laughs> right, let's do that.